Hey, it's Jason with Dad's That Cook, and we are out here with Mark Pasternak. Yep. At Devil's Gulch Ranch. He built this place when he was 19. Unbelievable. And we're hanging out with Mark. He's going to show us some cool stuff with squab. Squab. Baby pigeon. Hmm. Uh, they're usually harvested when they're about three weeks old or so, three to four weeks old. So you're, you're trying to catch them right at that point when they're the most roly-poly and haven't yet used a whole bunch of muscles and stuff. Just Go cut ahead. the little head off, huh? Yep. Four little feet. And now you can make a little good luck charm, you know, maybe with the feet. My wife does that, actually. What I do is, is, is basically the same thing as a spatchcock, which is I uh -huh. cut out the backbone. And then what I'll do is... Oh, you're going to try one of the handy dandy knives, huh? All right, so you're using the boning knife that we've got from Dad's That Cook. Is it, is it good? Yeah. This is a good test from a rancher, you know. So the legs and the, the wings and all that, you're going to cook those separately. Braise. You're going to braise, braise those. Yeah. Braising is, is cooking in a water-based liquid, not submerged. They have about a half inch or three quarters of an inch of a water-based liquid. So I saw you just threw in a little bit of orange juice to do your I'm gonna braise. braise in orange juice. Put some salt. You did the, the, salt, the smoked salt, pepper, and yeah, like yeah, a lemon fingers. pepper. This one, yeah. And we got the wings. Wings legs. and legs. Yeah. The whole point is you want to keep All the right. lid on. You want to keep it steaming. Now, I will turn it down. Ghee butter. It's, it's clarified butter. Yeah. It's wonderful stuff. All right, so this ranch, as we drove up, there's 75 acres, okay? And please, you have to tell how you got started with this ranch. It's my earliest memory since I was two. My, my dream was to, you know, live in the country and have a horse and, and raise animals and all that kind of stuff. I, uh, I moved up here with two horses into my sister's house, <laughs> she and her husband, and the horses are in the driveway. In oh, they in must have excited. Yeah. Yeah, see it steaming? Oh yeah, that looks good. Yeah. You came up here, you started to build a house on this ranch at 19 years old. The barn was here. It was oh. built in 1866. It was falling apart. There was an old house that was falling apart and a couple of sheds. Uh -huh. um, I think if I knew then what I know now, I don't think I would have done it. No. I mean, I, I had no idea how hard it was. And did you have a thought of, I'm going to have animals besides the horses, right? Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. yeah I, mean, I wanted to have the pigs, the goats, the, you yeah, know. Yeah, I wanted cows. to have, you know, a working ranch. I wanted to have the animals. All right, so we can get these taters going, huh? Yeah, taters. And you're just going to dump it right on top. Yeah. We got ghee and butter. We're really going nuts. Yeah. Good thinking, Mark. Okay. Now this one, we're going to have to keep an eye on and just be stirring so not only do you have a ranch not only do you cook and you make squab for us you've got kids right we do. how many do you have we have we have two daughters my oldest one is lydia a doctor of physical therapy wow my my younger daughter is kyla she's the one that you see at the farmer's market sometimes oh, okay. and helps us out and cooking for the family right what does that mean to you to be the the chef the cook it, it was interesting that uh, lydia said how much she appreciated after she left <laughs> yeah, you know, it's like hey, going going away to college. It's like it's not really all that good of food. You know? So uh, that was that was gratifying. Uh -huh. Oh, let's get those breasts, huh? So what did you do to marinate? You just did the same uh, salt, pepper, yeah. Yeah, just dry, lemon pepper. Dry marinade, yeah. Okay. All right, we got our squab. Okay, that's my first experience here, Mark. Okay. okay. That's what you want. You want it red. Yeah. yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Wow, so soft and moist and flavorful. That's better than quail. I mean, it's, it's even better than chicken. I mean, it's, it's definitely in there with the duck family mm -hmm. to me. Oh, I love that. I love the orange juice. In yeah, there. yeah, it came out stronger than I expected. Yeah, but it's, it's great flavor. Mm. So we had squab today. This is what we cooked up with Mark here at Devil's Gulch Ranch. Check this out. Squab two ways. We had breast sauteed in ghee butter, a little salt, pepper, lemon pepper, and then we had the braised legs and wings in orange juice, mind you, which was to die for crazy good. good. I love that idea. And then some potatoes that we did ghee butter and butter in. Yep. And some onions. onions. Simple, easy way. I mean, it wasn't difficult to make, but let me tell you, the flavors are crazy good. If you want to check out the recipe, it's going to be on dadsthatcook.com. Go check it out there. You can also go to devilsgulchranch.com and you can get yourself some of this incredible squab, lamb, pig. They've got all kinds of stuff here. So, yeah. but hey, thanks, Mark. You bet.